Hello there, how are you doing? I'm doing really well because today I'm going to make some more bread for you. I know, I know, you love when we make bread together. And this time we're gonna work with a different flour by once again, the mill and folks guys from Hungary, Saged. Can you say Saged? Try it, say Saged but probably you don't even know what's that. So it's an amazingly beautiful city, far, far away in Hungary, where that weird guy lives who always makes bread. So today we are going to work with this basic one that is actually based on starch, all right? And we're gonna add a little bit of sugar to our water, just so that this baby the yeast is going to start to work. We're gonna add some salt because salt is the salt of the earth. And we have some oil here. And once we have all of this together, we are swirling it and mixing it. And then that's all. Oh my God, it can be that simple. Of course it can be. You can make everything simple. If you're hanging out with the right guys, and that's me in your case, because I'm gonna show you how easily this comes together and turns into a beautiful, beautiful bread. Okay, just pay attention that you're picking up all the flour from around and just remember that you can use this bread with any kind of addition to it. You can, for example, put in it lots and lots of different nuts you can stick some rosemary in it if you want. And of course, what would the life be if we didn't add garlic to it, all right? So oh, this is a bit tricky. And we're just gonna pour it in. And so I'm gonna tell you what's going to happen to this dough. Whoa. There it is. So we are going to bake it for 50 minutes in the oven and then we are going to take it out and take it out from the baking paper and then we are just going to bake it again for another 20 minutes. So let's do that. Isn't it a perfect and beautiful loaf of bread? Mm, let's just cut it. How should I do it? How should I do it? Let's do it in the middle. Mm. Oh my God. Wow. What are these perfect bubbles inside? Mm. I can't wait to taste it. And I think you guys are also ready to taste it once you're getting your own Mill and Folks gluten-free bread flour mix. The basic one on Amazon.